Welcome back to Let's Play Gun. It's time for Mission 7, Law and Order. A lot of rewards, the most important of the two, two new guns. So let's wander on into this saloon casino here and have ourselves a handy dandy cutscene. Looking for hoodoo, I'd wager? This nope. way. Come on in, kid. We were just about to hold our usual confabulation before the night shift begins. I see Rudabaugh has already made your acquaintance. This is J.J. Webb, my other right-hand man. Now tell us about this fellow you're looking for. Jenny said something about him being a jack preacher. Reed's his name, Josiah Reed. What do you want with him? It's a personal matter. Hmm, I see. Tell you what. I could use a crack shot like you. You put this on, and I'll see if I can find some information on that scalawag weed. When that skunk shows his face again, you'll have the law on your side. What do you say? I hereby deputize you, Constable. Empire Police Department. Spotted Chavez, he's Chavez in town. What's going on? Key player among the resistance is in town. If you boys can nab him, it'll be a big step toward restoring some law and order here. Get going! Yay, we're a sheriff now. Maybe they'll let us join in on their confabulation tonight. <laughs> Whatever the hell that was. No uh, pick a horse, any horse. We're gonna pick the one that's facing the right direction. And head off yonder with our gun pride out of our belt area. Oh, video game characters are just so good at hiding weapons. I mean, this guy's got like five weapons on him now, and you couldn't even tell. Let's investigate this saloon type thing. Bartender, what's going on? Where's Chavez? He just left. Before that, Talking to them too. Well, I don't know, man. This this here problem's getting pretty big. If the Apaches don't start pulling this thing together, I don't know what we're gonna do. Law. It's amazing how much better everything sounds with headphones on. Anyway, these people are trying to kill us, and they're really fast at putting them those masks on. We're just like, oh, law, boop. Right, while the cutscene was uh, kind of transitioning, they're like, let's put our masks on. Because I'm sure they didn't see us for that two minute long cutscene. Huh? I better want Clay. <laughs> Get up! Also, I think the guy we're after, I think they said his name was chavez -y Chavez. What kind of name is that? Oh, man. You know what? I don't like my first name, so I'm just going to have my last name be my first name and my last name. And then I'm just going to put a E or a Y as my middle name. So it's Chavez and Chavez. chavez -y Chavez. Yeah. yeah, I'm just that important that I should be named twice. Oh my god, go more guys in masks. Can't talk almost said gore guys in masks. That would have been a uh uh one of them grammatical things. I don't know. <sighs> so this mission's really short and easy. You kill people. Just I'm kinda of sensing a pattern here. A lot of these videos you just kill people. <laughs> but believe me, it never gets old in this game. It just never does. Especially since you can trample people with a horse. That's pretty nifty. Pretty dandy indeed! Oh, and the last guy squealed his last squeal. Don't kill us. Let us go. Guess we missed Chavez. 
Square! Let's go! Whoa, whoa, what are you doing? They were unarmed. Bullshit. As Gracer was pulling a gun. Didn't you see it? I saw it clear as day. You better get wise, kid, if you want to stay alive. You shot those folks in cold blood. I'm taking you to Hoodoo. You dumb rube. Who do you think we take orders from? Hoodoo's been playing you and your little whore like a fiddle. Keep your hands up. What are you gonna do? Shoot us in cold blood? Yeah, Rube. Who's the murderer then? <laughs> It didn't really take much time developing the whole relationship and trust between us and Hoodoo, seeing as this is our first mission working for him and we're already betrayed, so it's not that much of a twist. Great job there, Neversoft. Oh, that's okay, though. I guess this way, the story just progresses a little bit faster, and that means that this LP will be done sooner, or something like that. Yeah. Now here I had the wild idea that it would be a good idea to shoot the horse instead, but this thing has so much health. Oh my god. Maybe because I only shot it in the butt and the stomach. But its stomach acid should be pouring out all over that guy's legs, and then he'd just sizzle like bacon and stuff. Ah, the horse, Colton. The horse, Colton. <laughs> Drink up your whiskey. For it'll steady your aim. Yeah, and that's... Sure. Oh, dude, that horse just did a front flip. That was badass. This game has the best horse physics of any other game. All the other games that have horse physics suck. Like, uh, Call of Juarez. Actually, I don't think you even get to ride a horse in that one. But Oblivion? Oh, God. Horses look so crappy when you're riding them. And we got the Colt Double Barrel. It's a new shotgun. It has twice the fire rate and something like range. And the new uh, pistol, which has 10 rounds, which is awesome. Even though, and it reloads faster, but it has a slower rate of fire. Not too slow, though. And yeah. Sweet. We didn't really need the faster rate of fire since we already reloaded it really fast. But anyway. See you guys next episode for some ranch handing.